This video was made possible by EA Game Changers. The following footage you're about to see was recorded at EA Play 2019. Everyone and welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new. I'm Eliantra and welcome to my first speed build using the new Sims 4 expansion pack, The Sims 4 Island Living. This pack doesn't come out until the 21st of June, so a few more days to go, but I got to play this pack early at EA Play in LA and we had so much time to record this time. Like I needed maybe three or four hours to record the four videos that I had planned but when I was done recording those videos I still had like an hour and a half left and I was like what do I do with this time I don't want to stop playing so I was like okay I'll try to do a build so this build is very very rushed considering I also started another build before this I've used maybe half an hour of my time and I hated it so I deleted it and then I started this one so this one is built in maybe 40 minutes or something so super super quickly trying to use all the new items so it is kind of like a hurried rushed build but I think it still turned out really good and I hope you like it we're building a little beach cabanas that's what I'm gonna be calling this they're really really cute but yeah oh my god we had so much time and even after I had done I was like done recording this the next day we got more time and then the next day we got more time well I don't know we just keep I kept getting more time which was ridiculous we had so much time. I wish I had known beforehand how much time we had because I could have built something so much bigger and better but luckily I am getting early access to this pack soon so I can download it onto my computer here at home and then record something else for you guys so I'm really really excited for that but this is my last video that I recorded at EA Play and it is this cute little beach cabana build so I don't really know what this lot is it's definitely not a residential lot it could be a bar I think there is a new lot type with this pack called beach, but I'm not entirely sure I didn't really look into build and buy mode and the world that much I kind of just focused on the, some of the gameplay features specifically and then the create a sim items So I think there is a new lot type called beach, but I am not sure But if there is then this could be a beach, but I don't know what the requirements are but basically there aren't even bathrooms that I couldn't fit them anywhere and I was in such a rush. I just left them out, you know, use a bush or something. We only had the island living pack and base game for this. Otherwise, I definitely could have used a bush from like Sims 4 get together because it comes with these bushes that your Sims can go and pee in, which is fun, I guess. So <laughs> I could have used those, but we didn't have them at EA Play. So these are cute little cabanas. I don't know, they're pretty big. The, the game actually comes with this thing that I would um, call a cabana. It's like this really cute, I don't know how else to describe it, but it's like a little, how do I say it? It's like a <laughs> square thing that has like a roof made out of fabric and you can put your lounge chairs under it. I'm so bad at describing things in English, but I'm gonna try to use it at some point. So I will point it out for you guys, but it's so cute, but it is like really small. It's, by, it's like two by two. So I wanted to build some bigger cabanas and we have a new foundation with this pack, which are these beams. Again, I don't know the official name of these, but you, you can basically build on top of water and then it looks like your whole building is supported by these beams instead of having just like one huge huge block foundation so I love that they added that and yeah as you can see they added a lot of lots in this world that are like half in water in the ocean so you can build in water which I think is so cool there is no houseboats with this pack which makes sense because in the sims 3 you could take your houseboat and you know travel on to another world but in the sims 4 we don't even have an open world so that doesn't really make sense so instead we have these lots that are partly in the water so you can build over the water how cool is that I really really like that aspect and we have these little new um 
what are these called, stairs that you can put on your foundation and your sims can go swimming from the foundation, it's like a little pier. I think that is so, so cool. I don't think you can use those stairs anywhere else though, like you can't use them inside to like go to a different floor, they're purely for water purposes, but I still really, really like them. I added a new campfire outside and this pack came with a lot of new trees, a lot of new palm trees and a couple of new outdoor plants as well. And I'm so glad it did because these palm trees are amazing. We definitely needed some new ones and we got a lot of different options. I love that like leaning one that I added on the right there. It's so freaking cool. And then the smaller one in the front. I love them. And then as you saw, I also put some water activity stuff outside. So there's the canoe, the Outrigger canoe. I put that outside and I put some water floaties. I don't, don't remember what they're called. Why am I doing this voiceover when I can't remember any words? I don't know. I am recovering from being really, really sick. I'm actually getting a lot better. I think I'm almost 100% now, so I shouldn't even use that as an excuse, but I will. My my brain has been fried by the sickness, but thankfully I'm getting better. I know some other simmers got more severely sick and they're still struggling with it, but luckily I didn't catch whatever they managed to get. I'm really sorry for them. By the way, I love these new lights here. There's a couple of really, really cute new table lights little lanterns and then that little one with that like flowers and a candle in the middle and there's also a candle here on the bar I love them there's a couple of new plants and I love that bar as well it's very on theme for this island and for my build loved it so I wanted to make this cabana into like and a bar cabana and the other one just has seating areas. I think I put in a TV. Like I said, I was rushing this. I mean, it's still a good build in my opinion, but it's definitely very rushed. If I had hours to work on this, it would have been like 100% and really, really good, but it's, it's like 70% uh, now, <laughs> like 70% um, perfect. I don't know. It's still good. I love these curtains. They're so, so pretty. There's a couple of different versions, like bigger ones as well. They are gorgeous. Uh, one of my new favorite items from this pack, love the curtains. And obviously yeah, you saw the lounge chairs on the back on this pier. Oh, this is the cabana item that I'm talking about. I don't know what it's called, but with these curtains, do you know what I'm saying? Like, that's so cute. It's one of my new favorite items as well. It's so, so pretty, but didn't go with my build. I built my own huge cabanas. And oh my God, they added these like glass things on the floor so you can see through into the water how freaking cool is that that's honestly the coolest thing ever like my dream honeymoon location has been for like the last 10 years to go to Bora Bora and you always see those pictures of those like uh, cabanas and whatever huts they're called um where they have the little glass things on the floor where you can see the fishies in the water because the houses are on top of water and like the eye that in the sims that I was so excited when I saw it because I want to go there and I've been wanting to build some Something like that something Bora Bora inspired in the sims for the longest time and finally I can because we have a beach world so I don't know I love that item it's so cool so yeah I really love that there's so many cool new items there's a new ceiling fan some new ceiling lights I love this coffee table in the middle the round one and I love the materials used in these items as well they're just they're so good so yeah I tried to use as much of the new stuff as I could but obviously I didn't use all of it and I'm excited to build more once I actually get the pack so hopefully next week we might have some other builds but I am thinking of doing a little let's play with this pack I'm not a very good let's player I always get bored of playing like one family or like trying to find some content to film a let's play episode but I'm gonna do something short I think short I'm good at if I know it's gonna end like when something happens then I'm good to go so if you guys want to see a uh, let's well, let me know in the comments down below because I if you guys want that that can be uh, made to happen but yeah we're pretty much done with this build as hurried as it was but I managed to finish it I mean I think it looks really really cute and I love this a lot health on water and yeah I'm gonna show you guys some screenshots you can see a lot of the new items and these little peach cabanas that I built so unfortunately they won't be on the gallery because I did build this on EA play and all the files and this build are left on that computer over in Los Angeles and we didn't have gallery over there so 
Um, you, you guys can try to recreate this on your own if you have Island Living and chose the base game or just build something similar. But I had a lot of fun building with these items and I can't wait to build more. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did, if you're excited for Island Living and leave your build idea suggestions down below. I'm not that much of a build channel anymore, but I can build something cool if that's what you guys want to see. And if you aren't subscribed yet, don't forget to subscribe too. And that's it for this video. I will see you guys again soon for some more island living content. Thanks for watching and bye!